Hello, everyone, and welcome to my channel, Zen Within Me, and welcome to Tarot Tuesdays. Okay, so today's reading is going to be for Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising. Let's see, what are your love messages for this week? What are your love messages, Capricorn, for this week? Okay. Uh, I pay attention to how the cards come out also. I'm getting an energy for either you or your person. Someone's always getting involved in something, always mixing things up. Like just, it, it's it's inconvenient is what I'm hearing. What other love messages do we have for Capricorn this week? Okay, and what letters? I'm going to pull letters from my initials, traits, and features oracle deck. You can purchase this at zenwithinme.com. What letters are relevant to Capricorn at this time? By the way, happy birthday, Capricorn. Okay, what letters are relevant to Capricorn at this time? Okay, so we have the letter M coming through. So uh, however that resonates, this could be city, state, country, somebody lives in, initial, anyway, M, I'm getting like the color maroon. Um, how, however it resonates with you, and if it doesn't, it's fine. This is a general reading. If you want a private reading, you can go to zenwithinme.com and purchase one. And we can get the skinny for your private life uh, there. Also, you can sign up from an email newsletter. There's a pop-up that will show up when you're new to the uh, zenwithinme.com website. Okay, I feel you even though we are apart. I will wait for you. Uh, excuse me. I will wait for a sign from you. Okay, so this is. these are nice messages. Okay. Let go of the need to control. Allow this situation to unfold naturally. Unrequited feelings. There is not enough love to keep this relationship going in a healthy way. Take a leap of faith. Only when you're willing to step out of your comfort zone will you reap great rewards. Love your shadow. Accept and work with the flaws in yourself so you can learn to accept others as they are different paths you are not on the same page with the person you have in mind the directions you want to move into are different okay that's a doozy and be optimistic keep in mind that you create your reality you can't attract love with a negative mindset okay okay so now let's get some other messages for you, Capricorn. What other messages do we have for Capricorn? A fiery climax approaches. You might be dealing with an Aries, okay? So we've got something spastic coming up. Okay, now career cards. What's going on for Capricorn? What messages do we have for Capricorn? What messages do we have for Capricorn? Okay, we have crystals. Your connection to crystals and gemstones is a channel for healing energy. Okay, so definitely want to get involved with some crystals here, and this is going to help you. Sensitivity. You're becoming more sensitive and need to make changes accordingly. Okay, so definitely for those of you, especially if you're an empath or if you're getting more sensitive with your abilities, you're definitely going to want to get some protection crystals. Okay, to help um, limit the amount of negative energy that is uh, drawn to you or that you absorb. I would highly recommend uh, like a selenite necklace because selenite, it could be a bracelet as well. Uh, but a selenite, I, I would recommend the necklace because it's close to your heart chakra and your throat chakra depending on like how uh, long or short you hang it. But selenite is self-cleansing. So it's going to be constantly cleansing where other crystals you'll need to put them in like a selenite bowl to cleanse. So I recommend selenite and you just leave it. Also, Palo Santo bracelet. I sell those. Check out zenwithemeat.com. You can find them there. Cleansing, healing, fantastic. Uh, I don't have mine on right now, but I I have gifted them to my family, my parents. Like It's, it's like our family little symbol. We all have our Palo Santo bracelet and it's awesome. My 90-year-old dad wears his Palo Santo bracelet. 
he, you know, forgets things sometimes, but for the most part, he remembers to put his bracelet on. I love it. He's so sweet. Okay. And then we have artist engaging in artistic activities is beneficial to your career and every other area of your life. So definitely do things artistic, whether it's your career or something to do as a side hustle or just to be therapeutic for you. Okay. What other messages do we have for Capricorn? What other messages do we have for Capricorn? What other messages do we have for Capricorn? Okay, we got one here. Okay. Ah, the cards. Hang on. Okay. Okay, we have the Empress here. Earth Energy. Number three. Excellent communication and creativity. Someone who is generally optimistic. So you have that creativity coming through here with the, the art, uh, being uh, an artist in some way. Abundance, nurturing, fertility, feminine, good parenting, development, accomplishment, growth, evalu uh, evolution, and action. Okay. Good card here. I'm also getting here like this nurturing energy for some of you with the sensitivity and the need to protect yourself with crystals. I feel that you are naturally a nurturing person um, and that's why you will need to protect yourself here, especially if this is a new, um, a new, uh, I'm trying to find the right words here, new, um, this is just new to you for the spirituality and the um, abilities and stuff like that. I mean, everybody starts somewhere. We're not just born knowing. It's it's all a path. It's all a, a learning uh, lesson and everything. So no worries. And this channel is for everyone. So if you have some questions, just make comments down below. And either me or someone else, um, you know, watching the channel will be more than happy to assist you and make comments and stuff. Check out my Instagram. Also, I'm always posting encouraging things there. And you can also check out my TikTok for all kinds of posts. That That's like everything. <laughs> my real estate, everything. My spirituality, everything's on TikTok. So go and check that out. Uh, and it's Zen Within Me. If you just do a Google search, it's Zen Within Me. It all is there. So have at it. All right. Those are your messages, Capricorn, for this week. Thank you for joining me for Tarot Tuesday. Make sure you like, share, subscribe, and I will see you next week. Peace and love, darlings.